Hey there, everyone. This is Alcal playing this game here. <laughs> Mega Man X DLC. So, two days ago, someone did respond to comments saying that the change of hard mode is just numbers. You know, you do less damage to enemies, enemies do more damage to you. Good, great, I got it confirmed. It's like the worst possible answer, but I mean, I'm glad to know. And uh, Roy Curbs further kind of went to check it out on the Switch version, only to find that, um, yeah, like they were not able at all to like see any difference. So this to me means that <laughs> they, just, they just added this little extra panel all around the side. That's adorable. This is going to be the finale. Uh, what? Wow, that. Oh my god, the menu. I don't know why I'm having so much trouble. Oh, wait a second. There's multiple stages, so we're not near where, anywhere close to done. But then it loads up Sigma, so maybe we are close to done. I have no idea. Alright, well, here we are. I. Do I recognize this? It's very green. Yeah, so all my stuff is back. Oh, you're there. Alright, that's cool. Mr. Tank uh, is there looking great. Alright, so I'm just gonna destroy you instantly. That's how we do things. I mean, I reckon this is the song from the first stage of the Mega Man's, but like, I don't recognize where we are like at all. We're in a place that does not exist. It's just like in this weird abstract corridor station. Alright, for fun and games. I want to use my, so I feel like the blue shot takes too long to come out. Like, you're just kind of just sitting here, and it's like, yeah. But, you know, yeah, exactly. Glad we had this talk. I'm gonna go up this ladder. It just looks like a bunch of textures. It's pretty good. Oh, shoot, I'm supposed to move on here. All right, Mr. Walkie, is, he can keep on walking. It's like, oh, it's ladders, so you can actually just go. Okay. That's what ladders look like. Uh, can you not? Okay, you can. Can you not go backwards? I guess not. Build me because I was not aligned anymore. It's possible that I have no idea what I'm doing. That's not just possible. It's an actual fact. Uh, all right, buddies. I'm gonna just take the time to destroy you in case you have health to drop. Uh, thank you for your knowledge. Now we're at another level up high, where nothing is going on at all. So we're gonna do it again. Here comes the bot. It's vile! Zero just appeared. Alright, he's gonna take it off, so we're fine. Everything's gonna be right alright. This is it. This is my powerful... Oh, now I... Oh, wow, you can back out to open it. Can you air dodge? No, see, I can't, I can't seem to be able to air that. Yeah, this is this room. So we're just kind of, instead of teleporting on Sigma's front yard, we teleport, like, actually in it somewhere. Oh, no, we put him in a capsule. Go ahead and blast him. Grimon Zero. All right, well, this, a lot is happening here. Yeah, and then Zero's gonna break out of the capsule. That's right, I remember how this works. Where'd you go? He uses ghost powers to become not there. Wow. Ooh, that was a mighty little punch attack you got there, Vile. You gotta be careful. Zero, get out of the way, Zero. We're having a very intelligent... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I needed that help, honestly. <laughs> like, I, I think I had this covered. But it's okay. I respect it. Oh, except you did kill yourself doing that. That was silly. That was silly. Where did you come from? I'm full of health again. What? That's my gun. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. Well, I prefer to be terminated. I'm gonna mostly circle strat and kind of be confused where you're at. Uh, you got that little orange gun shooting citrus blast, and then you dash around, kind of awkward, not not making sounds. I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, I feel like a dash attack feels more like an attack. See, like, you just kind of went through me? I didn't even lose health. What are you doing? You're supposed to drop a grenade? That's, look, I'm, 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 it's fine. I'm not actually, you know what? It's gonna be, like, moving around like that. And then I can do that. And that did, like, a ton of damage. That's worth that. Like, if you're predictable, using the charge gun makes a lot of sense. 
It's just that I, I can't predict how I'm going to move, let alone how my opponent is going to move, so that's why I kind of don't bother. Except turns out if you just dance with him, just do a tango. Yeah, I did it! Stage clear! But we're still here! What does that mean? Oh, wait a second. So, this is gonna be like four things back to back to back? And then you can just kind of load in where you need to load in? That's, I think, what is happening right now. A shot at bad in the face. Okay, alright. I mean, this is a continuous stage. It doesn't, like, get interrupted by anything or anything. Even if it says stage completed, I don't know. It doesn't feel completed to me. So, I'm going to dance around and kind of dance around. Yeah, that's, that's right. I'm going to heal my armor. Yeah, yeah, by the way, peeps were right. Like, this armor is probably a downgrade over the old armor. Uh, the, the, like, armor the first. Oh, so we are refighting bosses? But this might take a while. All right, well, here we go. Like, we didn't refight, um, the Wunger. Like, there are boss refights in the first of these, but there's only four bosses. Yeah, Kawunga doesn't exist. That, that could be why. Okay, alright. You all know it's no one. We're gonna do about it. We're going to dance. So yeah, I do not have any weapon upgrades, because I ran out of health. Just like, getting the armor and like, getting like, my heart smaxed out. So, there you go. So we're gonna have to do this, uh, oh shit, I thought you were, yeah, you're making it snow there. Where are you gonna land? Where are you gonna land? It's right there! I missed terribly. I did that, that is true. Statues just kind of fall to places. Uh, it's just not a very effective attack in 3D, man. I mean, it could be, It's but it's not. I missed completely. Yeah, like I said, like, it's just very hard to, what's that hole, no, ceiling? You know, it's a chimney. Oh, we, okay, the fight lasted too long. We got, we got some music loops going. Oh, shoot, then you kind of did that penguin bop on me. Not a fan of that. It's very impolite. You're not using any, like, ice ball attacks? I don't know why, but you're dead now. You did your best, chill penguin. Oh, then, like, the camera's like, no, this is where you're going. It's that, it's not that door, it's that door. <laughs> okay. Hey, we got a miner. He's just sitting there. He's like, hey, oh, I'm throwing wrenches over here. It's not wrenches at all, it's pickaxes. Is that a thing in this game? Can you throw a pickaxe? I feel like something you should be able to do. Alright, so I'm kind of stuck. Now I'm here. I don't know what that means. Oh, okay, so that's probably where I want to go then. The ladder, not the pit with the enemies. Yeah, I kind of recognize where this is supposed to be. It's, uh... I'm surprised they're going at this length, honestly, in ports. But then you just got like the butt of a bunch of flying enemies there. And, yeah, they're being very effective when you're allowed to aim upwards. It turns out... Oh shoot, uh... I don't know what I'm looking at. What happened? I guess I... okay. Oh, and I... they might respawn? I don't know. Alright, so that's basically supposed to be a unreward. It's a punishment drop, making you return here and be extremely confused about the universe all around you. But I just want to go up and figure out what I want to do. Alright, this looks pretty good. This is where we're gonna refight Eagle, right? Like, it's the Eagle Bridge. Maybe. I'm- oh shoot. There's a pit there. <laughs> Don't mind me. All right, it's Eagle Face. He's got the ability to point at me. Oh no, that actually does damage. It does not just stun, well, push me back. Unlike his little, like, feathery attack there. That is pushing me back like a pro. Pro pushback, 5,000. I don't know, like, I see my health bar flashing. But, wow, that was, that was a pretty good refight duel. Truly, oh wait, but that's this whole stage. Yeah, now we're switching music. I guess we're going to the real base now. Yeah, this is like second half of the Sigma Fortresses. So instead of uh, the face, Bengaranga, we just, just get Storm Eagle. Yeah, he's doing his best. I mean, maybe Chill Penguin was like part of that. I don't know, man. So maybe we'll have two boss refights here and then we'll have Sigma. 
I don't know. I'm just saying things. I'm just making possibility jabs where you stab at the concept of possibilities. All right, all these guys are just not worth it. You guys have fun. I'm going into this unsecured empty room. We saw that saw blade. That ostrich got a sword in. That's pretty funny. All right, well, here we go. It's against our middle He's hopping mad. He's so angry to be here. He's like, why do you keep rebuilding me? All I want is the rest of Oblivion. You are just like way too far up there in the sky and no one knows where you are when you do that, man. Yeah, so this guy, you don't want to use charge shot, so luckily for me, I just shoot all the time. It should be like trying to roll at me. It's a lot more fun, because, yeah, there we go. No, I can't shoot you while you're rolling. Never mind. You should like stand there and not do anything. Sort of like what the eagle was doing. The eagle is like the ultimate boss fight in terms of convenience. <laughs> Oh, jeez. I don't know where you are, ever. It's pretty good. Right, like, I can, like, try to charge shot. I just, you move way too much. Armadillo's known for, like, moving all over the place. That is true. That is their trademark. Uh, I wish I had Spark Shot. I feel like if I had bought a weapon, Spark Shot would have been it. Because it's Sigma's uh, weakness. But it's also his weakness, which would be good for me. Welcome to an awkward little space in time. What's that? Oh, it's just bats, but they're like really close to the ground. It's very weird. It's like they knew meat was about, like robot cyber meat. Ah, oh, jeez. Yeah, like this is not cre- Enemies are just falling on me. It's pretty good. Alright, hey buddy. Alright, you, here you go. It's like, yeah, like everything kinda always exists. And I've kind of been following me around, and so they were all just waiting here for me. And I've lost my armor. Does... I don't know if my sub-tank will bring it back or not. So, you know, like, I don't want to just use it. Alright, look at that. It's this guy. Stink a million. I thought he was the most, like, fight fight. It's a dumb statement. I just... I didn't know where you were. And he's just gonna make things fall all the time? Like, yeah, that's gonna be a real test. But, like, as the one that felt the most dynamic by far, it's like he moves around a lot and he does, like, a lot of things. Okay, well, let's see what happens. Now he teleports. He's now somewhere else. Whoa, look at his super long tongue. Super weird. I mean, it makes sense. I always like that about the Mavericks, though. The Maverick bosses is that not only can they use their element, such as him, his ability to stink, uh, they can also use their animal aspects, and that's cool. But then sometimes I feel like because of that, their elements, so to speak, gets extremely underemphasized. Like, you know, Stingman, I feel like he would do things that would involve stinging a whole lot more. I feel like, I know, I'm kind of think they just called him Sting Chameleon because it's like, no, you know, he stings with his tongue, I don't know. And they, they kind of, he is, he is his animal. But like Spark Mandrel, he has both Mandrel abilities and Spark abilities. Like, that's like the best of both worlds. Chill Penguin has chill abilities and Penguin abilities. He's mostly all Chameleon, but that's okay. Chameleons are really cool. I mean, Zero's obsessed with him. Like, Zero is a big fan of the concept of the Chameleon. Yeah, so, boss stage, this is now the fourth stage, a platform just violently appeared. Okay, oh, yeah, not violently. Alright, yeah, this is the final shaft. Normally you'd be climbing the walls and grubs would be falling on their head. We're not, we're not bothering with that. <laughs> and I get that, and I understand that, and I respect that. This is kind of freaky though. Like, with all the wall textures around? Like whoosh, and you are really going up into a realm you have no understanding of. Oh geez, it's Sigma and his dog. Uh huh? Destroy you? No, not yeah. Well, that's you're a good pet owner. Betrayers? Did I betray you? I don't know. There's var var var. It's a dog. I I don't know how to say his name. I don't know if I ever heard it said. I'm right. All right, he's running at me. Yeah, uh, so Dog Boss normally is just like all over the place and he throws a lot of projectiles. This one definitely carried the all over the placeness. 
but is not a mini uh, Danmaku event, and that's probably good. Oh, there you go. I mean, it was pretty slow. Oh my god, I got tackled by a dog. The dog tackle. Yeah, look at that. He kind of sniffs the air and then he blows up. That's a powerful attack. You did it, puppy! Alright, Sigma. Awkwardly turned towards me. Towards friends arrive. Is it the same text? Oh, you just threw that away. Uh, that song? Alright, so Sigma has his mighty dash. Tackle. He's trying to block with a sword and it's not working out. Okay, he still has... Oh, that... I, I love how jank this is. This looks... Oh, Sigma. Sigma. You are not made for someone who has the ability to just run in circles. <laughs> oh, you actually blocked! That's pretty good! Good job, buddy! You did it. Well, I'm kind of like looking at your knees. You're like so much taller than me. <laughs> like, this is neat! The way he's moving and everything is cool. It's just, as far as attack pattern goes, it is not equipped for someone with my ability to navigate all three axes. Oh my gosh! He removed, he kept that. Oh shoot, I pressed a button, but I think that doesn't matter. No tax or anything? No, he's just... We're here now. Yeah, see, if I can just... If I can just shoot up at you... This is a lot less scary. <laughs> and if I have move rooms to more or less just... Ignore the giant pause again. This is a significantly less scary. But I love this! I love how this was recreated. I feel like this told a completely different story. <laughs> I love <laughs> oh, hey! Check that out. We did it. <laughs> so this is like a screen. Like they lock my control and they show a screen. That's how it works. And now nah, I guess that's it for the credits too. Uh, <laughs> hey, that's still Penguin. I guess you forgot. It's Penguini. I call him like that. I don't know why. Oh yeah, instead of them appearing on top, that's the that's the best they can do. That's, that's okay. <laughs> I honestly love this janky little thing. I think this was a lot of fun. Uh, again, this is literally my first time playing Minecraft, so I have no concept for how hard or easy anything was to do. I just don't know. I, 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 I do not have any, like, way to compare. But, so, as a Mega Man fan, who set out to play all the Mega Man platformers, and then playing this in this engine, I thought it was a lot of silly fun. I don't know, I feel like I got my $10 worth. It's fine. It's pretty neat. I do not know what is this game's target audience <laughs> other than me. <laughs> well, yeah, like people who play Mega Man's. And uh, I'm sure there are like people who are saying, yeah, I did it. Thanks for making, like for real. Uh, so it is a, um, a, a studio, but I mean, it could be a studio one person. I don't know. I just do not know. Fade out. Victory. Yeah, like, like it's people playing Mega Man games, and I, I'm sure there are people whose, like, job is to play all the Minecraft, like, adventure little zones. But beyond that, like, is, is there a fandom for Mega Man X anymore? I did it! I saved everyone! Oh, yeah, that's right. You got exploded. Now <laughs> you're just back. <laughs> okay, so now there's speed run mode, tie attack mode, or boss rush. All things that I do not feel the need to go through. Like, I, my goal is to play what there is, and I have accomplished that. I mean, there's a lot of value. Yeah, there's hard mode, speed run mode time, there's boss rush. Like, there's a lot of value in this package. Like, there's a lot going on. Even with only having four Mavericks, I I think this was silly. But like, silly fun. Like the best kind of silly. I, I like this. I, 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 I don't think this will make me play Minecraft though, regular. 
Like, while I'm sure exploring worlds and stuff is something I would genuinely find fun, I don't think the harvesting hundreds of materials to craft specific recipes and keeping a handle on that, like, that is the opposite of attractive to me, so that wouldn't change. But this, though, this, though, I liked a lot, and I'm looking forward to returning to it for Sonic. Speaking of which, next time, we're returning to Sonic.